hello guys welcome back to our youtube channel so today we bring to you just on yomi fabi on his return to nigeria he decided to visit baba Sui's grave in order to pay his last respect to the king of comedy in a video that surfaced online yomi fabi was seen stepping out of his car holding a flower bouquet in his hand and walking straight to the graveyard of baba Sui. well a lot of netizens has reacted to this saying that is he filming a movie or he was just there to pay his last respect to the late movie icon. Yomi Fabi prayed that the soul of the late actor would continue to rest in peace, adding that Baba Sue would never be forgotten. He added a caption saying, and I quote, upon return to Nigeria, I made it a point of call to pay visit and offer prayers as part of my last respect at the gravesite of the boss and pathfinder, late King Baba Tsunde Ayinla Nurudin Omidino, aka Baba Sue, who passed away recently. May your soul continue Continue to rest in peace, Pressy. An era is gone. You will never be forgotten. I sincerely and personally miss you, sir. Odi Bakono, R.I.P. End quote. This was your Mifa Biyi letting us know that he is back in Nigeria. As at the time Baba Sue was pronounced dead, Yomi Fabi was away in London, Manchester specifically. He was not in attendance like every other of his colleagues in the Nollywood industry at the time of the burial and the eight days Fridal prayers done for him. But Yomi Fabi took his time on social media to be part of the ongoing processes that happened back in December 2021 for Baba to waste barrier and also he took it upon himself to make sure that fans in manchester held a prayer on behalf of baba Sui and also paid a tribute and a candlelight service for him in a picture i shared online and added a caption saying baba Sui was an era in comedy he deserves every support he got from his fans and lovers when he was acting when he was sick and now that he passed on to celebrate and pay tribute to him everywhere is a sign that the nigeria community always places high value to life of sacrifices service and dedication wherever we are we still have the culture of gratitude and we exhibit this regardless memorial and candlelight services in manchester and london scheduled for thursday 2nd and friday 3rd december 2021 respectively in his honor this is huge the family industry and friends hold this in high esteem it will linger forever thanking you in advance for your decision to attend and honor this icon yomi fabi and quote this was yomi fabi letting us know that the fans in manchester who are showing support and paying tribute to the icon uh, their effort is duly appreciated yomi fabi who arrived in nigeria shared the video and added the caption that says paying his last respect was dragged by netizens followers and users wrote and i quote attention seeking attempt through the cheap popularity stunts if you so much cherish the departed icon why not help the family make the grave descent a pile of clay more after several weeks is not descent for the memory of a great icon as baba suwe umidino another user who is also a follower of yomi fabi he said his grace isn't even properly covered yet flowers on a pile of clay and then four cameras to add colors and the voice of god to prayers hey 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 another user said all this now cloud chaser jerry must you do video for us to know or for the gram were you shooting a movie there the camera is too much sir some things are better done off cameras now i feel like you are chasing clouds with what you went there to do this and more are the reactions of netizens on social media instagram specifically dragging your family left right and center asking him why not help the family cover the grave properly well in my opinion i think it is the duty of the family that the grave of baba Sue be properly covered and tiled and make it look even more decent than just heaping piles of clay on his gravesite. yes family friends can also come in handy in cash or in kinds but knowing fully well that your father is a public figure whether he's alive or he's dead people will still have one or two things to say about him his gravesite should be the first thing that should be properly done decently but some netizens believe that yomi fabi could have done better by helping make the gravesite decent enough before putting it out to the public since he claims to be a protege of baba Sui, seeing how netizens came for him he also took to his instagram page to let people know that the easiest way to get a bad name is to help an ingrid he shared a picture and added a caption in the picture there was a write-up which says and i quote the easiest way to get a bad name is to help an ingrid their entitlement and audacity is the worst they did 
deny everything, blackmail, play dirty cards, and engage short memories. It gets worse with social media, blogs, and comment sessions. You can't aid a blatant ingrate on social media and escape the karma now or later. The consequence is that most on sick or deadbed may be alone as if they never have any legacy. The caption that followed this says, and I quote, If God designed you to help and lift 10 people in your lifetime, and Satan hijacks, manipulates, or redirects eight ingrates your parts, it's the biggest tragedy. Confirm multiple jeopardy. If you are not careful, what is supposed to be your legacy will be what may destroy you. When trying to help, be explicit and pray well about it. Hence, you don't look like a person with a problem. Many users turn up as weak and needy. Do your best and leave the rest as quickly as possible. Social media aids ingrates more. If the ingrates can play the social media tactics more, be wise and careful. End quote. This was the Mifa B subtly shading all the netizens who came for him, saying that he could have done better by cleaning and making sure that Baba Sue's grief is decent enough. Recalling that before the passing of Baba Sue, Yomifa B held a surprise birthday for Baba Sue. In a video shared online, Baba Sue was spotted shedding tears of joy as he was surprised by Yomifa B and he also returned on set where he acted in one of the movies produced by Yomi Fabi. If there's one thing that Yomi Fabi did most and made the world known is that Baba Sue was the one who gave him the opportunity. Lessons and experiences he has today and whoever Yomi Fabi is today was because of the opportunity given to him by Baba Sue. The passing of Baba Sue Yomi Fabi shared a video of himself and Baba Sue on set and he added a caption saying and I quote, How can I ever forget this day Percy? I don't even know what to write again. I care so much and thank you for trusting me with a chance to care and be a child to you. Your laugh to my words jokes or movement i will remember all i mean all we discussed the lessons and experience thank you for the opportunity you gave me in the movie industry still in shock check on my mom tell her i miss her and love her too endlessly end quote this was yemi fabi back in 2021 paying homage to baba Sue. and on his return he did the same thing by paying his last respect but sharing the video with four cameras wasn't cool with some of his followers and he did sit well with them as well one thing we keep forgetting is that these people leave for the grab they leave for the camera and being on camera is always and has always been part of their life we all have reasons for doing what we do and i'm pretty much sure yami fabi has the reason why he came with four cameramen to the gravesite of baba Sui. well we pray once again that the soul of baba Sui continue to rest in peace and be with the lord well guys they have it do not forget to like subscribe and drop your comments in the comment section below thank you bye